Hello fellow sneaker customizers. Today I am customizing a pair of Air Force Ones featuring Rapunzel from the movie Tangled. This is a two part series and this is part one. I will be releasing part two next week. If you like watching these videos, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Also leave a comment down below as to what you are currently working on. And these are the Air Force Ones I will be customizing today. Brand new out of the box. I already removed the laces. I will not be using any of the masking red vinyl tape today. However, I am removing the factory finish with a leather prepare and a glazer from Angelus Direct. I want to keep my desk somewhat tidy, so I'm using a Nintendo gift bag as a barrier for the die. And this is the purple leather die purchased locally. Because I'm using so many colors on these sneakers, I did not want to paint against a white background. I wanted to paint against a purple background. Therefore, dyeing the leather purple would be my best option. However, before I use the dye, I am using an adhesion promoter just to help the dye penetrate the leather a little bit better. A sponge brush might be a little more thorough when applying dye, however all I have at my disposal is a paintbrush. I am very glad I put down a barrier for my dye. Now it's time to mix up the purple base coat. And for this, I'm using Too Thin, Duller, and the Violet, all from Angelus Direct. However, before I start the base coat purple, I'm going to do one more quick layer of the adhesion promoter all around both sneakers. I really love this matte purple tone and to achieve this matte tone you need to mix in the duller with the violet at the beginning. I have my images printed out and I will be using white Sorol transfer paper and the Amazon affiliate link to the white Sorol transfer paper can be found down below in the description.
and it is very very easy to attach the printed image glued to the Sorrel transfer paper using masking tape. While all of the paints are straight from the bottle, I am also dipping in a little cup with a mix of too thin and duller. Adding a navy blue dark but very light wash around the purple swoosh. And again, I broke this pair of Tangled Air Force Ones into a two-part series, and this is part one. I will be posting part two next week. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me through my Instagram or my website. Both links are down below as are links to all the products I used in this video. Big thanks to Angela Strick for the paints, and thanks guys so much for watching.